hit TV first, and then video source button right here. Yep. So video source button, and then pulls up that menu. I labeled all your inputs to make it easier. So every time you hit video source button, it'll toggle it right there. Cable. You just keep on hitting that. All right, so if you don't have no volume, you don't hear anything, what you want to do is hit audio because you have to ask what device to do what command, mm -hmm. and the command is volume up. Volume up. Volume up. Oh, stop, stop, stop. There's a, then there is a fault with the DVR. Oh, uh, yeah, I know how to do it. You have to turn the cable box off and on. Cable box off. All right, and then hit cable power. See, the volume control was working. It's just the, it, the it signal. Didn't. It was an error in the cable box. So there's another reason to get rid of that cable box. Yeah, it's another reason. It was a software glitch when you change inputs. It didn't uh, toggle the volume. But uh, yeah, just turn off the cable box, turn it back on to uh, fix that problem. Oh, and you can also hit audio, power, to turn off the Bose soundbar. And the way I have it connected, you can actually use both. You, you can use the TV and volume up. So would you ever use both or they work together? Sometimes you get echo, but you could try. Let's see. Let's see if you get an echo. What do you think? Audio, I power. I think that whoever they are online, whatever that thing is. Oh, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I, I just think it's made up. But how do you feel anyway? You hear about echo? Melanie Claus. Ridiculous. 